How to have healthy hair. Three parts. 1. Using healthy washing and styling habits. 2. Using healthy products and avoiding damaging treatments. 3. Making healthy lifestyle changes. Change your washing routine. Do you wash your hair every single day? This can really dry it out. Since you're washing away the oil your scalp produces to keep your hair shiny and healthy. Washing every day can also lead to oily hair. Since stripping your hair of its oils causes your oil glands to go into overdrive. Try this routine instead. Wash your hair just 3 or 4 times a week. Giving your hair a break in between washings will restore its balance. It might be a little oily for the first week or so. But your hair will soon look more healthy and vibrant than ever. Rinse out your conditioner with cold water. Hot water is hard on your hair and can lead to split ends and frizz. Rinsing out your conditioner with cold water seals the cuticle, resulting in shiny, bouncy hair. Handle your hair gently. Think of your hair like your best silk dress. After hand washing it, would you ball it up and wring it out? No, that would destroy its shape and fibers. Your hair is similarly fragile and needs to be treated with care to stay healthy. After washing your hair, gently pat it dry with a towel instead of wringing it out. Let it finish hair drying. Use a comb instead of a brush. Forcing the brush through tangled hair can cause it to rip and break. Use a wide to thick comb to gently work through the tangles from bottom to top to prevent breakage. Use heat styling devices sparingly. Put away your hair dryer, straightener, curling iron, and hot rollers unless you have a special occasion at hand. Applying heat to your hair can damage it. So it's best to let your hair air dry instead. If you want to use the blow dryer sometimes, use it on a cool setting. When you use heat styling devices, be sure to put a protective serum in your hair beforehand. Use homemade treatments. Try an egg yolk and olive mask, a vinegar rinse, or put plain yogurt or sour cream on your locks. Search online for instruction. Use egg oil aisle box. Egg oil contains omega-3 fatty acids, antioxidants, and cholesterol roll, and is like a complete solution to hair problems like hair loss, gray hair, and curvy hair. Use natural hair care products. Commercial hair care products promise great results, but they often contain ingredients that can dry out your hair and leave it looking limp and dull. You'll probably notice a difference right away if you switch to products made with herbs, oils, and creams made that nourish hair. Most shampoos are made with strong cleansers called sulfates that strip the natural oils from your hair and cause it to get frizzy and frayed. Choose a natural, sulfate-free shampoo made with cleansing herbs and oils instead. Check out a natural foods store for options. Try using no shampoo at all for the least amount of chemicals. Conditioners made with aloe, coconut oil, shea butter and other pure substances add moisture to your hair and keep it looking healthy and fresh. Avoid using styling products that contain a lot of chemicals with names you can barely pronounce. You can make your own hair gel and hair spray instead of using the store-bought kind. Try to stay away from dyes and other permanent treatments. The chemicals in dye, bleach, Brazilian blowouts, chemical straighteners, 
and chemical curlers can do a lot of damage if you use them too often. Give your hair oil treatments. To restore your hair's softness and shine, apply oil to your roots, shaft and especially tips a couple times a week. You can use oil in place of conditioner or after your hair is already dry. Once every few weeks, give yourself a deep conditioning treatment as follows. Massage olive oil or almond oil into your hair. Cover your hair with a shower cap or plastic wrap. Let the oil sit in your hair for two hours or overnight. Rinse it out with cool water until the water runs clear, then shampoo and condition as normal. Make an aloe hair mask. This will help your hair to look shiny. It also improves hair health. Use it twice weekly. Grab an aloe leaf and peel off the outer to reach the transparent gel. Apply the aloe gel all over your hair. Leave in 4 10 to 15 minutes. Wash the aloe out with water. Eat nutrients that nourish your hair. A well-balanced diet with plenty of protein, vitamin B, iron, and omega-3s helps your hair stay as thick and healthy as possible. Vitamin B keeps hair thick and strong. Eat plenty of fruits, vegetables and nuts to get enough vitamin B. Eat beef, chicken, pork fish and leafy greens like kale and spinach to get iron and protein. Salmon, walnuts, and avocados are excellent sources of omega-3s, which help your hair stay shiny and healthy. You can supplement your diet with vitamins designed to make hair stronger. Try prenatal vitamins, which contain a mix of ingredients that lead to great hair, nails, and skin. Protect your hair from the elements, just as you would protect your skin from sun, wind, and cold temperatures. You need to protect your hair as well. If you don't, it will dry out and become brittle over time. When the sun is strong, wear a hat or scarf over your hair to protect it from getting too fried. Don't go outside during the winter with wet hair. When your hair freezes it can get brittle and frayed. You should also protect your hair from chemicals. Don't expose your hair to chlorine too often. When you go swimming, wear a swim cap. Image titled Have Healthy Hair Step. Get your hair trimmed often. This is an important step for keeping your hair healthy. You should get a trim every six weeks or as soon as your ends begin to split. Keeping your hair trimmed will make sure the ends don't split very far up the shaft. Your hair will be less likely to break, and it will look healthy and full of life. Please like, comment, share, subscribe our channel and with us. Click our other social media side and no details.